Hello, assalamu alaikum and welcome to my YouTube channel and viewers. In today's video, I'm going to show you that how Quirigio can change Vivo Y66 model, I mean number. For this procedure, first of all, open QC5 tool, then go to the flash tab. Now, check on program and select the uh, firmware, which link is mentioned in the description. Select the firmware one. When the file is loaded into your uh, QC5 setup, simply click on flash. After this, the tool will I'll uh, ask you to connect the device. So simply turn off your device, press volume up and down, key and connect the data cable. The phone will be put in ideal mode and concave Q loader mode 9008 and the tool will detect it. Uh, detect the device in Q loader mode. After that, the flashing process will be start and finish. Once the flashing is uh, done, the smartphone will be turned on. After that, you can see the uh, my smartphone on the screen. I'll show you the model number and the IMEI. As you can see, my model is Vivo Y66 model, and uh, we have to fix its uh, IMEI number. So the phone is successfully flush uh, with the first file. After that, simply go to the read in tools tab. Before that, you have to add the sport star dash five double eight dash. Once the menu is open, simply uh, click on the second option and uh, click on debug port. Once the debug port is enabled, uh, the contact network port will be shown in your device manager. After that, simply go to read and tool uh, tab. Now, in security function, select repair IMEA and execute. When this pop up uh, appears, simply click on yes. After that, again click on, uh, you click on yes because we are using the di diagnostic co port method. Once that's done, now this uh, click OK and uh, select the diagnostic port so as you can see our ED port is connected in the NMC port so simply from here select the port which says diagnostic and press ok once this is done the, the tool will start rep uh, repairing your IMI and it will ask you know, to write down your new IMI so well, simply in IMI tab 1 down the first IMI in IMI tab 2 down the second and click ok after that the phone will be start doing the tool will start doing his job uh, and repairing your phone and uh, as you can see our phone uh, and, uh, is just uh, uh, repaired over here after that you have to simply reboot your smartphone once the device is reboot now simply open the dashboard and check the IMI. so let's see that our device IMI is repaired or not as you can see our both IMI is successfully repaired now we have to uh, fix our uh, phones at uh, home. As you can see, we don't have a place to in this firmware. Uh, this is Chinese firmware. So for, the, for that, you'll have to work a flash tab. In the program tab, simply right click and thus, uh, select the second file, which link is also measured in the description. After selecting the second file, the file will be loaded in your QC file tool. So simply click on flash. And now simply turn off your smartphone and connect in radio mode for that. Simply press volume up and down the and connect data cable. The Q separate tool will detect the smartphone and start uh, doing its job by flushing the firmware which we selected. Once the second file has been flushed to the device successfully, now the phone will be successfully reboot, update the uh, start setup, and now as you can see, the Play Store uh, has been uh, in this room. So this is the fixed row. So now uh, you can also check the IMI over here to confirm that the IMI which will return is in the same condition. So using this method, you can simply repair the IMA of the PO Y66 model. Simply double it to the Chinese room, then repair IMA. After that, simply finish the global law. So if you like the video, please like the video, comment down your thoughts, and don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.